Hi loves, so I apologize for my last video, I know my voice was kind of quiet, um, a lot of you know I've been dealing with some pretty bad health problems lately, um, and I really wanted to get it up for you guys because I was asked a lot and you guys just make me feel so happy and I love the community and this all just makes everything so worth it. Um, so I figured I'd show you what's in my number two wide Rowena that I bought off Carrie. I am so thankful for her because she hooked me up. This is like the, probably my favorite Foxy fix I have um, because it's just so perfect and I love the leather. So on the front I have, um, she also gifted this to me uh, this week and I added uh, the stickers, you got this, and I put warrior um, on the bottom. Um, and these are PT exercises I have to do every day, and behind here are also PT exercises I have to do. Um, my body took a pretty hard hitting. Um, if you didn't know, I was in the hospital for sepsis, and my neck was really bad. It felt like it was paralyzed, couldn't move it, had to pretty much relearn how to walk. Um, so still recovering, and taking it one step at a time um so on this side i have these two little charms this one is from mystic's little gifts and this one is from uh oh i have something down below it's on the top tip of my tongue <laughs> uh oh my goodness i completely forget what it is um, I'm sorry, I'll link it in the down bar below. And then I have these charms. Some of them for, are from Exo Carolyn. Uh, shout out, as we both have the same name, but spelled differently. Um, and then some other ones that I just made myself. Um, so I'll take these out. And it does, you know, it gets marked up. But I feel like the more you rub it, the more it kind of comes off and it just feels so beautiful. Um, oh, and here's the top view. How cute. Alright, so. Let's see. The pen I use is one I got from uh, some BST group. And I don't know the name of it. But if I can find it, I will link it below. But I have yet to be able to find the name. And yeah. <laughs> but it writes beautifully. It's very thin. Um, I am still trying to look for like a fountain pen. That's like a mini one. That's in budget. Or a Coletto pen um, that I'm waiting on. So yeah, if you have any recommended pens or pencils that you use, please leave them in the comments below because I'm always trying to see what writes best and please excuse my pajamas I'm, I've been in my pajamas all day and I have no shame <laughs> so this I have decorated for Christmas finally I have these polar bear little uh, post-it notes that I got from Carrie this I got from uh, Sally just a little fox it was so cute and then this I got from um, Addie this, I forgot who I got this from. This might have been from Addie too, I can't remember. Um, and then this little background piece was just a letter um, that Addie wrote to me that I thought was so cute. And I decided to keep it in there. Um, this is a dashboard by one of my best friends in the planner community. Her name is Michelle and her shop is Bullfrogs and Fireflies. And I mean, can we just talk about the Santa and elf cuteness on here for a second? <laughs> Um, and then I have this let it snow thing, a little pocket, I'm still trying to figure out, um, what to put in here, but then I also have this little penguin clip that I always get asked about, and he is from Barnes & Noble that I got from, like, 10 years ago, and I was trying to look for it, and I actually found it on Amazon for, it's like a set of two for $10. So these, like, I get requests. I'm like, how, everyone's like, where did you get it? I need one. Um, but yeah, check out Amazon because I think they're going out fast. So I'd get on that. <laughs> and then this is a little folder that I also got from Carrie. 
and I use it to hold my stencils. Now, you won't believe this, but I have a total of eight stencils so far, and I won her giveaway. So, I'm thinking about gifting some of these um, that I know I'm not going to use um, for Christmas to some of my buddies that they don't know about yet. <laughs> and then I have these cute, cute snowman bracelets. I am just obsessed. And then I have this notebook, which I can't show because that's my Christmas secret Christmas list, wish list, expenses. That is way too much, but that's okay. Um, then on the other side are just, you know, um, maybe I only have seven. Oh no, I have four on this side too, so eight. I'm obsessed with her stencils. They're so pretty. And they're so functional too. It's perfect. And then I have, what is this? Oh, these um, llamas for lettering holiday um, printouts that you could use to kind of guide your hand lettering and work on your lettering, your doodles and whatnot. Um, so that's that. And then on the back of the dashboard, I just have these two little ephemeras and some washi. I got these two from Addie again. Um, and then these, where the heck did I get these from? I know her name's Arlene. Oh my goodness, guys, my head, I can't even. I will I will definitely link them below for you, I promise. Um, and then this dashboard, I actually saw, and I wanted it for so long, and Carrie gifted this to me with, um, when I purchased her uh, Rowena Wide, and it says, slow down, calm down, don't worry, don't hurry, trust the process, and... This just spoke to me so greatly, especially what I've been dealing with, so I just have to have this in every notebook I have. And then on the other side, I have this um, Cardiotisa um, card that uh, my friend's mom actually gave to me. We're both Catholic, um, but... This is supposed to heal, help heal you and just protect you. And they blessed the card and they gave it to me. So that was really sweet of them. So I just like to keep this on me at all times, you know, just in case. Because um, just the stories I've heard with this are just incredible. Um, and of course, to go along with that, I put a Bible study in here. Um, just when I want to write down some devotionals, um, you know, on the go. And I was going to have, like, a whole binder dedicated to Bible study, but it was just getting too complicated for me, and I kind of just want to use one notebook at a time so that I could have it everywhere with me, and I get, I have both the, um, the new Bible and the app that, um, sorry, not the app, the emails that goes with it, so I figured I'd just keep one of them in here. Um, and on the other side of that, there's like a little pocket here, and this was from, um, a monastery we went to in San Francisco, and it says always, oops, always go forward and never turn back, which I love because this is, this quote has stuck with me since 2006 is when we went, so that would be 10 years, a decade, <laughs> um, just taking it one step at a time. And then this is another dashboard from Bullfrogs and Fireflies. I absolutely love it. And then I put a picture of me and the fam um, in a little border. It says enjoy and some Christmas washi. This is one of my favorite pictures ever. This was actually at my Sweet 16 exactly um, almost 10 years ago. So there's that. And there's this cute little kitty, um, and I have my list section, so everything needs to get done. Yeah, it's just not to do this or fun, right? But this actually helps me because I, I like, you know, just writing everything out, and then the other side, I will kind of prioritize things based on category and star things that have to get done like right away. Um, so I find that does help me. And then this other list, um, I just do like book. Um, books that I want to read, and as you can see, I have a lot, <laughs> um, but my goal for 2017 is to read seven books, um, I almost got to the ten that I had for this year, 
Um, I'm working on my eighth book, but due to everything that's been going on, um, I think I could give myself a break for that. <laughs> um, and then, and did I forget to show you this paper clip? Oh my goodness, what is wrong with me? These are, okay, for, what am I doing with my life? Okay, this paper clip and this dear paper clip are both from Bullfrogs and Fly Fireflies again. They are so cute and are paper clips that will actually stick and won't slide off because I've had a problem with some in the past. Um, but aren't these perfect for winter? I just adore them. And then I forgot to show you the inside of this. So this is just a little devo mini devotional I did. Um, and then a protection prayer from St. Joseph that I read every morning. And then if I'm going to be working that day, this is a prayer um, for, for work from St. Joseph as well. Um, so, where was I? Oh, yes. Address book. This is essential for people who, um, have pen pals like I do, for people who have horrible memory like I do. I need to write addresses down where I'm going to be sending mail, um, even receiving mail, and all that good stuff. Um, so I will not show you that because that is personal information. But we do not want to give over the internet. Um, and then this is the other side of the list. I kind of put them together. Um, and then this is the my inbox. Uh, so this is also... Whoops. I think this is also a... Is this another... Okay, I forget. I can't remember if this is from Mystic's Little Gifts. Not Mystic's Little Gifts. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, wait, what's the front of this? Okay, yeah. This is the other side to that dashboard. And then I have online purchases, which... Let's, let's be real here, guys. This booklet will be filled probably within the next two weeks. Because my Christmas shopping has just been out of control. And, um, yeah. So there's that. And then this is another dashboard by uh, Bullfrogs and Fireflies. So cute. I'm obsessed with penguins. If you guys did not know, like, penguins are my obsession. And then my happy mail. And I got this cute little paper clip from Mystic's Little Gifts. Um, the little smiley face. It makes me so happy whenever I look at it. So I figured I'd put it on the happy mail tracker. Um, from Annie Plans Principles. I forgot to mention that. These principles are all from Annie Plans Principles. Um, she is absolutely amazing. She's so talented, and her inserts are absolutely wonderful. Um, I give her so much credit, and I just need to learn how to cut them better <laughs> on my end. Um, but the amount of happy mail I received from you guys these past couple of weeks have been so overwhelming, and I just wanted to say thank you because it truly means a lot. You know, after being in the hospital for eight days and just really recovering and not feeling good. And it all came on the same day, so I was, like, so emotional. <laughs> so I, I have to go back and check and, you know, make sure I'm giving each thing the credit to um, its, its rightful owner. Um, so this is where I keep track of who sends me happy mail and who I send happy mail to. Um, I'm a little late on sending happy mail to people, um, because I am walking around with a walker at this point, um, so I, I can't drive, I can't really get around places very much, um, so I have to, you know, depend on family members and friends to help me, um, go get the supplies I need, um, but I do plan on doing some of that this week and next week. So this is the other side of that dashboard. And then this is another dashboard by um, Bullfrogs and Fireflies. I'm not sponsored, I promise. I bought all this with my own money. She is just one of the sweetest people. And uh, we have become really close friends. And I just adore her and her shop. And then this was a little bookmark I actually made. I printed this off of... Uh, I made this little word on uh, Adobe Illustrator, and I cut it out, I put like a little background behind it, and then I kind of clipped it um, to the back of this, uh, what, what do you call this, 
a um, one of those Heidi Swap. Drawing blank here, my memory. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's like a pocket folder, uh, slip pocket rather. And my tip for all of you guys is if you don't want to use a specific sample set that you get, like a sample sticker, a sample sticker kit, <laughs> um, then just make a bookmark out of it because you'll see it all the time. It'll make you happy. You don't have to stress about when to use it or, oh my God, I'm going to have to throw this out one day. So I just made this. These are from Tricky Sticky Stickers. And I just adore it. I am in love. Oh my god, these are not from Tricky Sticky Stickers. These are from pa Paper Studio. Oh my lord, I am so sorry. Wow, okay. Um. Yeah, I'm going to have to double check on that. But aren't these just so cute? And this Target cup, I want so badly. And this panda, like me. So, um, and this gold washi tape is from Arlene as well. So, I have some more ephemera, some washi tape. Um, this book I have chosen to use as a bullet journal, I guess. And these colors are my color codes. I use these on all of my calendars, all of my days, um, to make it easier. Um, and then I have this little purple washi, which is, uh, upside down, so I gotta change that. Um, so, so far I have this. I have my key, which I still have to fill in a few, and this was before I got some more of my stencils. So I might use this page as an index, and then the next page I might do more of the stencils, just so I can say, okay, this is what I'm going to use this for, and so on and so forth. And I love Dockerid, so this is going to be perfect for, um, bullet journaling, and I think I'm going to put... Um, more permanent lists in here, um, like my KonMari method that I've been working on for this past year. That was another goal I had set this year, and I'm about, I would say, like, two-thirds of the way done, but, you know, again, I just gotta, gotta wait till next year to do it. Um, and then more from there. I love this. Um, sticky notes. Thank you, thank you. I love you guys. Um... And this glitter washi, and then this I've had since I was really, really little. Um, and it's just my name, what it means, and heck, yeah, this is so true. Um, I mean, the glistening hair, the gleaming hair, I, w I, would, I would say yes to that too. <laughs> um, but definitely strong, you know, warrior all the time. And then this is my Hobonichi that I'm going going to be using for 2017. I'm so freaking excited. Um, this is a little paper clip that um, Addie gifted to me. And it reminded me of like a Chanel bottle. So it made me really, ha really happy. And I just covered this with like cardboard. Um, and then these are Annie Plans printables exclusively for the Hobonichi planner. Like... Oh my god, this was the perfect solution because the Hobonichi te Techo or Teco, I don't know how to pronounce it, only does the monthly spread and daily pages. And I really like having a weekly section just so I can write down important um, events or appointments that I have that need a little bit more room to write down. Um, so that's that's that. And I'm so happy. Like, she like answered my prayers with that pretty much. <laughs> Um, so I'll be using that, and then we go into it. Now I put some sticky notes here, um, a little hello thing. This was from the Happy Planner that I kind of just laminated with duct tape, <laughs> and then some washi that I got from the Six Little Gifts, and I started watercoloring. I love, like, this paper, guys, is just amazing. So I started decorating a little bit, um, and then last night, <laughs> I started work calling this, and it kind of came out like a hot mess, and it didn't really come out the way I was planning on it. It looked really freaking cute when, before the watercolor, but, you know, you're over and you learn, you can't, you know, it's, 
it's a book, you know, it's supposed to be messy, um, art journaling, you know, you just gotta get it done. I think I'm just gonna have to use a darker, um, pen with it, which, you know, is fine, but, yeah, so I'm gonna use this for, this is gonna be my word of the month, is heal, and then this is going to be my goals for the month, my to-dos for the month, um, my main, uh, financial goal is I have to get a refund, refund, refund really Carolyn refund from um school um because I'm starting up again in January which I'm really excited I can't wait and then this little dot is going to represent the blog posts that I will be doing throughout the month and then this little happy mail sticker from sweet kawaii designs these ever mentioned this 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 and this weekend banner and this workout and this plan sticker are all from sweet kawaii design and I adore her and her shop. Her shop was actually the first shop that I ever came across in the planning community, which really got me hooked onto planning, which then led to a million planners. So, anyway, this is going to be where I write down um, what I'm waiting on for orders because uh, I ordered a lot of stuff the past few weeks and I'm um, going to be receiving a lot of mail. I know I'm receiving like four packages today um and then um over here i just wrote the question stayed on budget question mark and i came up with a whole new budget um i started this week um so just you know trying to get organized with that and um my goal is just to stay on budget and to be smart with my money because that's all you can do and i did start today I started putting in stickers on for January, um, on this cute little credit card, um, but yeah, that's it for the Hobonichi, and I love how in the back, this is in the Japanese version, um, because it's like half the price of the English version, and I was like, hey, let's learn a new, a new language for 2017, so, um, I got a little photo translator thing, which I could, like, read what's at the bottom, which is really cool, it's really accurate, too. So at the back, it has some graph paper, so I will be writing down my goals, and then it actually comes with a lot of graph paper, which is really, really nice, and then it comes with a timetable, which I'm not really sure what I would use for it, maybe having something to do with um, graphic design school, and then it ha also has um, graph paper or something else, so I don't know what I'm going to use that for. And then it has favorites, so you can write down, like, favorite movies, favorite books, favorite, you know, makeup items, favorite, uh, planner shops and planners. <laughs> um, so it has a, quite a few pages of that, which is nice. And then my 100, which I thought was an awesome idea. So this is going to be what I want to do in the year 2017, and, um... I'm really excited about this. I don't know if this is, like, a thing that has some type of challenge that goes along with it, but I'm excited. So it has a whole bunch of stuff in Japanese, which I have no idea what it says, but it looks really cute. Um, and then it has gifts, so gifts received, gifts given, which I like, and then, I don't know what that is either. And then I have, like, cute little, okay, who remembers Lisa Frank? Lisa Frank is what got me into stationery and what got me into this whole planning obsession, and I swear. Look how cute that is. I found it in my drawer and, like, had to have it in my planner. And then this is another folder, uh, folder, pocket, and I decorated this, um, Christmas version. Oh, her shop is on the name of this. That charm is from, go focus, Metalhead Designs, Metalhead Designer. So that Christmas charm is from her. And I have some extra, extra graph paper in the back. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Um, and I will see you guys later. Bye.